What's up, my day? We back at it again with another freaking video. So, if y'all, if y'all watch my video, I did um girl talk. Like, really, I need some advice to help me get through this. Like, uh, and that is really not the best feeling. One, one for all is not the best feeling because you know I me, mean? everything like really happened so fast. Me losing my grandmother last year. It started out off last year. Me having the flu. I me having the flu, getting over the flu, then me finding out my grandmother had that mixed with then this year everything just uh because one my me applying for jobs and like why don't nobody don't wanna hire me? Like why? Then then dealing with doing YouTube like um for real it feel like I don't have a support system like for real because it seemed like everybody want me to get a job I'm trying but it's just nobody hiring me but if if the job I really want to do is be a DJ I want to be a DJ for a full time um if and I'll show I'll show y'all a little bit of my like DJ like a is lit. So me, I think I'll be the best DJ in 2019. Mixed with best you female YouTuber, one of the best female YouTubers coming up in 2019. Like is lit. So give me y'all a rundown. So then, finding out one, my I me breaking up with my ex boyfriend, and he he's still in contact with my family. Um, it just I'm tired of hearing about it. Like for real, I'm just tired of hearing about it. Because it makes me even more mad. Because one, the day you broke up with me, um, the day you literally broke up with me, I been I called you, and you didn't answer your phone, and then um, I called you a couple of times, but you didn't answer your phone. So okay, leave that alone. Literally two day, whole days later, we broke up that Tuesday. Then that either that either I think it was either three days. Yeah, three days. Three days later, we broke up that Tuesday. Like she, he sent me a message at one o'clock in the morning saying we done and my stuff will be. And my tablet will be on the front porch in the back. So, yeah. Um, literally that Friday, um, I lost my phone. Like, literally, I lost my phone. I would literally clean up my room. My phone fell on the floor. Um, I think I put it in a plastic bag. I put it in a plastic bag, and then me, I think get a lot. So, because I wasn't thinking. So, mind you, in the plastic bag, I put trash in it and took, there you took the trash out, and my phone went with it. So, like that, that happened. So I've been, 
since that happened in July and October now. August, September, um, it's literally been it, it about to be four months. Four. It's about to be four months since I, since the breakup, since I lost my phone. So it's like, oh, like. And then, come to find out, if I do get a new phone, I have to pay over $200 to get a replacement phone. But, come on now. Why did everything have to happen to me? And then, also mixed with um, me, me um, applying for a job, but nobody will want to hire me. That one really. Then, two. My glasses literally broke this year. I was sleeping in the car and my glasses was in my hand. So it broke. Then um if y'all didn't watch my L um my coming out story. So I had a coming out story that like literally happened. Um, I have a letter that went with it. <clears throat> so, so, basically me coming out to my family. Yeah, basically me coming out to my family because me, I wasn't ready. I, the only person know is my sis. That's the only person I know about. Everything that went down in my relationship is my sis. Because I t basically tell her everything. So that's the only person that knows about everything that went down. That knows everything. The reason why I'm, I became distant. The reason why y'all haven't seen any like ready post any videos of me and my ex lately. Um, y'all haven't seen none since since I did the um um I think the lyric thing or um the um. Lyric thing, lyric challenge. Um, guess the um, what, what, what the next lyric thing is. I think that was the last time I seen him. Him on my channel. Y'all haven't seen him in my channel in June or May. May or June, y'all haven't seen him in my channel. And so, because one. And y'all haven't really seen, if y'all did see him in my channel, it was only for like one time out of the month or so. One time. Because I became distant. Like, move. This became distant. But, um, yeah, um, everything just. It, everything just literally happening to me all this year. It made me want to yell, scream, cry, everything. And like literally, the only thing that helped me get through it is singing. So we, I'm, I'm, I'm about to find a song that I want to sing, and then I'll sing it for y'all. Okay. Wait. This is a song that literally just popped in my head. It's called Tasha's Car Break Every Chain. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. To break every chain, 
Break every chain, break every chain, to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. Tell it on me, rising up, yeah, there's an army rising up, there's an army rising up, yeah, to break every chain. Break every chain, break every chain, to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name. Jesus, there is power in the name of Jesus to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain, to break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. That was that was a little bit um be the one that that was one of my song and uh, um I listen to a lot of gospel sometimes when like I'm feeling like uh like <coughs> like some um have y'all ever felt like Have y'all ever felt like, like, with, I don't know how to say this, so, y'all felt like, y'all, like, you don't know what to do, like, what to do next, like, you trying everything to get y'all to do this, to do that, to do this, to that, nothing is working. Like, nothing is working. Like, like, I don't know. I'm, I've been feeling like this, like, literally for a while. Because it's very hard. Because me, throughout, since last year, I've filled out over 60 applications, over 60 applications, starting at the beginning of last year. No, not the beginning of last year, but towards like, like August, sometime in August to this year, and nothing, like and and you only got three replied back saying um come in for the interview, but when as soon as you come in for the interview, they said they'll call you back, but but they don't call you back. Like it it like really stressful. Like it's stressful mixed with like me. I'm trying to do YouTube right. This is my heart. I love entertaining y'all. And also, yeah, also, I try to entertain y'all. And then also, me, I love football. Yeah, I love football. I'm a die-hard Redskins fan. <laughs> it's sad, but I am. I am a die-hard Redskins fan. I already been a that hard racing fan since Santella. Santella was the one of the best safeties we had. So 
Being a Die Hard Raven fan, I be getting in my feelings mad. Like, don't want to be bothered because of our record. Like, zero and five. Because of that record, we finally got rid of our head coach, Jay Gruden. We finally got rid of him. Like, We finally got with him. So, all of this, that literally happening. And then, and then, um, me, I finally came out to my family. Um, yeah, um, a lot, a, a lot of y'all didn't know, but, um, I finally came out to my family saying, oh, it kind of made me happy, right? Focus on me, make me happy. So, um, I just went on. I, I wrote a letter. I, I didn't really tell them face to face because of how it came out last time. Um, I was dating this girl. We were just talking, like texting, like texting. We wasn't really dating. We, we were just friends, but we were like on the phone, like talking. But so every time, so my cousin came to pick up my other, my little cousin. So he told my father, then my, then. My, then, then he told my other cousin, then she told my mother, and then went back to everybody. That why me, I just stay to myself. I don't really tell nobody nothing that is going on because one, one I have, I'm trying to. Like, when I'm ready to tell everybody, that when I will tell everybody. When I'm not ready to tell everybody, that when I'm not going to tell y'all. So, yeah. So, me coming out and everything. So, it like, me, I have a mixed emotion. Like, me, me being my feelings, like, me being my feelings, like, if you know me, I'm always, I'm kind of always just, like, to keep my, be, be by myself. Sometimes I don't even want to be bothered. Sometimes just thinking about, um, it's just my grandmother. And, like, if when, when that time come, I just have headphones in. And sometimes I be in my room and listen to gospel music because um, I miss her. So, yeah, I miss her. One, one thing I miss is like um, every time I go over there, um, either I bed at night or go over there, um, my grandfather was always making breakfast and coffee. I would always, um, go upstairs, knock on the door and say special delivery. And she said, oh, thank you. And, um, I bring her food upstairs, stay upstairs for a minute. See how my how she doing and everything and um we just watch like crime shows like um federal uh, fatal attraction stuff like that ID so stuff like that and that one thing that I miss like me. That miss, she was there for every day. Like she was there for every day. 
when I went through, uh, went, went through me getting a, uh, me, me going through my kidneys, like, me going through, like, my kidneys, like, going back and forth to diocese on um, my grandmother and my grandfather was taking me to diocese and stuff like that. And also, I miss my other grandmother. So it was like my other grandmother that like, um, I think it was the 5th of June. 2014. I think it was the 5th of June 2014. So, yeah. June 5th, 2014. I miss her because, um, it wasn't, it was my graduation day. Like, it was already my graduation day. Um, um, last, last time I seen her, her, I seen her before I left for graduation day, um, I say hi, that is, I, I literally say hi, because that was my first time seeing her in the hospital, like that, and then, that was my first and last time seeing her. I wish I could have said, I, hi, I love you. Um, hope you feel better. Um, I still, like, sometimes I still look a little bit sad on my birthday because, um, so because because she always was singing to me, um, singing um, even when she couldn't sing to me, she would always sing happy birthday to me. I would always call her and say happy birthday, Pumpkin Pie. So it is like it hurts. Like the only thing I said was hi. Um. Now let's talk about my grandmother, Grandma Pat. Um, last time I seen her, um, we was I I was over there helping take I was helping my uncle take care of my grandmother, and and then I left and went to rehearsal. That was the last time I seen her. Yeah, that was the last time I seen her. And then, um, um, me, um, nobody didn't tell me nothing. I'm literally still hurt about it that nobody didn't tell me nothing. Like, it, it literally hurts me that nobody didn't tell me nothing. Um... So, it was my sister's birthday, so we, everybody went to Six Flags. Um, everybody went to Six Flags for her birthday. Um, um, it, it was that day, everybody went to Six Flags. Okay, I said, I was having a good time, having fun, and everything. Um... I think my nephew asked where we going. I think I said to my house because um, we have dinner, and 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 nobody then told. And then soon we pulled up to my grandparents' house. I I was like, why we here? I was thinking to myself, why we here? Like, why are we here? So, my cousin said, oh, go in there and check on your grandmother. 
um, your grandfather, see how he doing. I'm not thinking nothing of it. Like, literally, I'm not thinking nothing of it. So, um, so I went in the house, um, um, last I knew, grandma had was in the house. So, um, I asked my mother, where grandma at? Oh, she gone. See that? What? Like what? Like how? Um. So yeah. Uh, and 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 the whole thing is, I didn't see see her before she died. Nothing. I think I saw her like a couple of days, couple of days before she died, because I had rehearsal that day. And literally, I wasn't like, like, um, yeah, I saw her four days ago. That was the last time I seen her. I didn't say nothing because my grandmother was like off and on back to sleep, going to sleep, waking up, basically sleep. So I didn't see her. I didn't say nothing to her. Um, I literally got ready for rehearsal. And so, yeah, um, because me, I love to sing everything. Um, so, um, that Sunday, um, we went to um, Six Flags. Last thing I knew, um, the first thing I heard was, Oh, we cook it. My mother said she cooking dinner, and that was that. Um, so, um, so I guess they found out. I don't know. So, um, my brother knew at Sifflet, but the whole day is. The whole thing is. Why didn't nobody warn me? Like, why didn't nobody tell me nothing? Why didn't nobody literally tell me nothing? Like, it's... Like, for real. Why didn't nobody tell me nothing? Until... I asked, oh, where grandma at? Oh, she died. What? So, so yeah, she died. And I, I am still hurting about that because how I found out. Because how I found out. Like, she died. The whole thing is, I wish somebody would have told me. Somebody would have told me. Stop, don't, ba don't like baby me. I just wish somebody would have told me. Before finally be prepared. Like, oh, finally be better prepared. I was had still cried, but. So, yeah. So, all of this. Because that's still on my mind. Like, literally, how I found out. All, all I, all, all I know, it, all I could remember, all I remember, <laughs> that how I found out she died. Basically, me walking, pulled up to my grandparents' house, asking, "Oh, where's grandma?" 
Oh, she died. She in that bad place now. She not hurting no more. Like, why y'all didn't tell me sooner? That's still hurting me. Like, literally. Like, literally. I haven't very been the same. I haven't. I haven't been the same. That's why I've been in my feelings, not in my feelings, in my feelings, not in my feelings, because thinking of grandma. Like, why did nobody tell me? <laughs> Would they even told me if I didn't ask? Like... Would they even told me if I would have asked? So, like, it's, like, hard for me. So, it's, like, hard for me to, like, that why I, I be dissing myself. Because it's, like, nobody, like, nobody, everybody think, oh, I'm good, why, why is she so angry? Why is she have the attitude now? Why is she this, why is she that? One, I have an attitude because nobody, I was prepared. Like, I wasn't. Even though it happened last year, I remember the date by heart, May 20th, 2018. Like, what, like, if I would have asked, if I would, if I wouldn't ask where grandma at, what, what y'all even told me? Like, come on now. What y'all even told me where grandma, that she did or not? So, 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 that why I recorded the video yesterday, because I, because I'm still hurting. I find free, I don't have anybody else, like, been through this, like, everything, like, happening so fast, like, you want to scream, cry, cry, do everything, yell. Like, really mad. Like, so, yeah, right. So, um, so I'm like hurting. I'm still hurting. Like, I don't know what will help me get through this, but I'm still hurting. That all I know is I'm still hurting. Like, we had celebrated my grandmother's birthday this year. Went to the cemetery and did um blew, um blew up um let go of the balloons. Like I couldn't literally say nothing because I was crying. Because it's still affecting me to this day. Like But I'm getting, I'm fine, I am getting fine and don't occupy myself to not think about it. I'm like, like, um, sing, um, dance, do, um, make videos, do everything to not think about it, be like, because how it be like what a sad day for me because all I remember is rare grandma. Like was you was y'all gonna even told tell me? Like was y'all gonna even tell me that she did that that at least like when we was on the way at least called me to let me know, oh, why we're walking into, but nobody didn't do that. 
nobody didn't di do, do that. So now everybody like saying, oh, why are you being mean? Why are you angry? Why are you, why are you not talking? Why are you, why are you having an attitude? Why are you doing this? Why are you doing that? Did, did y'all look at how I, I felt? Like literally walking in the house. Um, literally walking in the house, expecting to see my grandma, my, my grandma, expecting to see my grandma, but and my grandfather, but but found out when I asked where she was, found out oh she died. She went into a bad place. Like what? And then went upstairs. Like with a stairs in the twin um in the um uh, in the bedroom in the room and start crying like why didn't nobody tell me? Like how hurt and mad I was really hurt. I was really mad. Like nobody didn't tell me. <coughs> so yeah. So yeah, um, so that's literally why I recorded the video bit for y'all to get new or why I recorded the video and the only thing that made me happy is recording for y'all. But um yeah. Alright, um this probably gonna be my last video I record for y'all about this situation because I don't want to cry no more. I don't. Um, but I just love singing and I love seeing Tasha Cobbs. Like, you, like, um, happy. Um, Tasha Cobbs made a song called Happy. It, it says, You make me happy. You make me whole. You take the pain away, so I love you. You make me happy, you make me whole. You take the pain away, I'm so in love with you. Everything about you is right. I love my own. Your life saved my life with you. But yeah, um, 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 so this ain't for this video. I'm not gonna, I don't do some more girls talk, but I need someone that can relate. Just tell me, oh, uh, comment if y'all can relate and, and comment what do you do if you, like, in this situation I am, I am in, even though it's been a year. The only reason why like I'm so mad because one I don't I don't have no more grandmothers. That is I don't have no more. I had two I actually had three grandmothers. One that when I was like little a a kid. Another one that um a day after my graduation. Um and the th and the third one that when um I found out after I went to sit flats, I had a fun day. I had a fun day. It was fun. It was lit. I enjoyed myself too. Too. Oh, I'm mad now. Like I'm sad now. Now why why did you tell me this? Like, why didn't you, you tell me? Why didn't you just 
um, why didn't you call me and tell me? Why did I have to go in the house and ask where Grandma was to tell me? Like, I'm still mad or sad about that. Like, it's sad. Like, why didn't nobody tell me? Everybody knew, but why didn't they tell me? Tell me that she died. Why did I have to ask? Like, if I would have, if I didn't ask, like, this is a question I had. Like, if I didn't ask, like, what you gonna, what you gonna tell me? Everybody is tired of me talking about it, but I'm mad. Like, why did nobody tell me? Like, if y'all were in my shoes, y'all would been mad too. Y'all would been sad too. Like you, after that good that fun day, you had fun and everything, laughing and everything. You walk into your grandparents' house and ask, "Oh, where grandma? Oh, she died. Um, she in that bad place now. She not hurting, but." Like, literally, why why didn't you tell me? That's the only question I had. Like, why didn't you tell me? You would have been mad, too, if you was in my shoes. That's why I have an attitude. That's why I'm mad. That's why I'm not the same as I was um before this happened. Like, I'm not the same person. I'm not. Because it's... It's hard to deal with it. Okay, y'all. Uh, this is it. I'm done talking about it. Um, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell. Comment team my game. Find out where my real subscribers are. And make sure y'all um, follow me on these two of my social media. That Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and YouTube. And all they get a shout out in my video. And comment. Hashtag my game, team my game. But we 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 coming out with the dropping bangers every single time. So peace, my game. Bye. Look, this sound like Cardi to the stage. Stay. This sound like Cardi with the braids.